Hi guys, welcome back to another review here on my channel. Today I'm going to review Cooks. I got this game for free by the developer, but still all the opinions are my own. So, it was a bit hard to figure out, but first you have to select one of those flames. Then you can select something here like double shoot. Then let's go to the first world. Okay, this one is the easiest, obviously. Okay, okay, those blue things here, that's our XP. And if we collect this, it raises, we are on level 4 already. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the first level. And then on the end, we get one box. Now we have new ammo. So you would think there is a portal somewhere. Um, no, certainly not. You have to press R to get back to the main menu. Now we can't select something. That's also pretty bad. Let's go to the gray level. Okay. Okay, we, we first have to shoot this one on the bottom so he doesn't kill you. And those little ones are annoying. Okay, more XP. Let's go back. Okay, higher. Okay, let's go to the red one. This one is a bit cooler in my opinion. So, there's some hidden XP I found on the top. Here. That's pretty nice. There should be some spiders, yes. Okay, and you can't see the character that well again. Okay, nice. Okay, I'm losing some health right now. Okay, and sometimes they get faster randomly. It's a bit hard. This stage. And I died. So, I keep my level and my XP if I die. But I have to play the map all over again. So let's see. This one here is my favorite world, I guess. It's a cookie man. But if you go to the end, let's see, almost. Okay, again, 100 ammo, easy. And if you go through that portal, you will find some nice guy. Okay, we aren't leveled up far enough to get him down but if we go higher 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 to the last stage okay okay, okay. i never even got that far okay okay I never even got that far. I streamed this game, so I have like one hour of playtime already. Let's go to a white level. Yes, it was the snowman. I think, I think I beat him, yes. And he drops like six um, 
XP bubbles. I got jump scared um, the first time I played it, but we have a lot of experience here. So it's worth it going here just for the experience. Okay, and I died again. So, a good ability I would recommend is selecting ammo 2 and it doesn't matter what ammo, um, if you take this, this or this one. They all do the same basically. So, yeah. But now if we try green level again, we can easily get to the XP without even killing one of those plants. This level is really good for getting ammo and done. And now we can press R again and go in again. We already have over 1000 ammo, but it's really fast this way. And let's go. Almost 2000 now. Why can't I kill them anymore? I don't care. Let's see if we can get... What level has the most ammo? I think this one was pretty good. If we just go down here. We just have to hurry now. Let's see, 1000 ammo. Okay, it's pretty good for shooting here actually. Okay. Oh no, 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 that's not good. And we died. But, yeah, I don't know. So, um, you would think there would be a main menu. If you think so, you would be wrong, since if you just press escape, the game just closes itself. There's no main menu, no settings, no nothing. You have basically seen all the game that has to offer. And the game costs like 2 euros, I think. So I don't know if it's worth it. You have to decide yourself. I think I probably won't have bought it since I've seen better games for the same amount of money on flea markets or in or used locally. And yeah, just pick up a Windows XP game and have like more content in it. But you have to decide for yourself. Thanks for watching.